what's going on guys live your zombies here back with another pokemon go video and in today's video guys we are talking about that upcoming hatch day event at the end of the month pokemon go did post on their twitter what the new pokemon will be featured in that hatch day do remember we have had two hatch days before for the pokemon riolu and for azuril too so yeah both times we have gotten baby pokemon featured in these hatch days and for this third hatch day that's going to be the case too another baby pokemon is featured and that is Kleffa, guys so yeah i had a feeling that they could feature Kleffa for the hatch day and that is because clefairy is getting a spotlight hour at the end of the month which i thought was pretty random so now it does make sense as to why we are getting a clefairy spotlight hour at the end of the month because a few days before that it's baby pre-evolution Kleffa is getting a hatch day event so yeah you guys see it right here man Kleffa hatch day is taking place on april 28th from two p.m to 5 p.m local time so the event bonuses for the cleffa hatch day will be two times hatch candy increased chance of hatching a shiny cleffa so the shiny rate will be one in ten for this hatch day so a one in ten shiny rate on getting that cleffa in two kilometer eggs as they state right there two kilometer eggs will drop a lot more often from pokestops so yeah pretty much every pokestop spin will give you guys a 2k and that 2k can only hatch cleffa during that time frame from 2 p.m to 5 p.m local time there will be a paid timed research to give you guys two times hatch stardust one star piece one super incubator and also some xp2 and that paid time research will only be one dollar guys one us dollar for that paid time research so i guess that's not like too too bad uh also this is the first hatch day to have extended bonuses guys this is pretty cool because it does finally feature in a hatch day event half hatch distance okay because the past two hatch day events did not feature any type of bonus for hatch distance but this one will be half hatch distance for the cleffa and that does start on april 26th at 10 a.m local time to april 28th at 5 p.m local time so even a few days before this event even starts it's gonna be half hatch distance so you guys can hatch your old eggs in preparation of getting these new two kilometer eggs of cleffa so that is a pretty cool bonus for this hatch day event and that might be the case for every other hatch day moving forward now also there will be some field research task rewards for xp and some stardust in that same time frame too from the 26th to the 28th so not too bad and yeah there will be some new boxes in the shop and on the web store too for i'm assuming some incubators for hatching the cleffa so yeah guys cleffa hatch day on the 28th 2 p.m to 5 p.m local time let me know in the comment section guys your thoughts about cleffa getting picked for this hatch day now for topic number two of today's video guys i do want to talk about this because a lot of people are asking me about this will ultra necrozma get featured at the upcoming go fest event because i have been making a lot of videos about the fusions of necrozma coming out for go fest more than likely at the global go fest on day two which that does seem very very likely at this point again check out my most recent videos about that and you guys will find out why because images like this have been getting pushed into the game's coding <laughs> again the fusions of necrozma are there it's a whole banner with necrozma and solgaleo and lunala right there so yeah it seems Seems like they are prepping for sure the release of the fusions of necrozma alongside the necrozma release and the shiny necrozma release we should be getting those fusions too but what about the ultra necrozma so i don't think we're going to be seeing ultra necrozma anytime soon i don't think it's going to be dropping this year but i will say this this got data mined new raid battle music for go fest 2024 it is a mashup of solgaleo lunala battle music ultra necrozma battle music and dusk main don wings necrozma battle music too so you guys can check out his tweets to see how this does sound it does sound pretty sick so yeah it does have the ultra necrozma battle music in there but again i think that's just because they're mashing up all of the battle music of necrozma for this upcoming go fest event i still don't think we are getting 
Ultra and Necrozma. I doubt they give us every single thing that deals with Necrozma all at once. I think we're just getting Necrozma and its fusions. Because do remember with Ultra and Necrozma, it's kind of weird how it's going to work in Pokemon Go. Because I do, I do think in the core games, because you have to use Ultra Burst, which I do believe is a Z move. Which again, obviously Pokemon Go does not have any Z moves in the game yet. So I'm not too sure how they're going to go around that. And do remember with the Ultra and the Krasma, you either have to have Fusion the Krasma, Dawn Wings, or Dusk Mane in battle. And it has to be holding Ultra and the Krasium Z as well. And then you have to use the move Ultra Burst. But maybe in Pokemon Go, they can make Ultra and the Krasma kind of work like a Mega Pokemon, maybe. Maybe you can like Mega Evolve, quote unquote, a Fusion, Necrozma, Dusk Mane, or Dawn Wings into Ultra and the Krasma with some sort of energy in the game and it will stay in that form for a certain time period whether it's eight hours five hours whatever maybe that's how they can make ultra necrozma work in pokemon go but at this point in time there has not been any coding for ultra necrozma or sprite assets for ultra necrozma so i don't think it's coming out for this year's go fest but maybe for some event in the future or they could wait until the alola tour which would be like 20 27. So yeah, guys, that does wrap up the Cleffa Hatch Day event. And also, if we will see Ultra Necrozma at this year's Go Fest, again, I don't think we will, but I do think we will see the fusions of Necrozma for the Dawn Wings and that Dust Man, which I'm very excited for. So yeah, guys, comment your thoughts down below about the Cleffa Hatch Day and Ultra Necrozma. Let me know what you guys think about those events coming up. Thank you guys for watching today's video. If you enjoyed, drop a like on the video, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.